Hello, this is Greg from SharePoint Maven. And in today's video, I would like to show you and explain how you can easily bookmark a document library in SharePoint. So here's the situation, here's the use case. I have this accounting site right here, and I have a few document libraries on this site. And uh, one of the libraries is this invoices document library. And let's say I spend lots of time on this library in this library, you know, pretty much every single day. That's like my favorite uh, library. I want to bookmark it. Uh, what you can do is use this feature that we now have called pin to quick access. Sometimes, you know, if you don't find it in the ribbon, uh, just click three dots and it will be available in the list here. But obviously I have it available here. So you just click on it. And now my library just got pinned. And let me explain to you what happened behind the scenes. You know, what are the you know, benefits of pinning the document library? Let me show you. Uh, so you will uh, find a few uh, kind of use cases. So first of all, if you navigate to OneDrive, uh, this is your, of course, personal you know, OneDrive, right? Where you see your personal files and folders. But look, on the left-hand side, it also shows me all the other libraries, sites and libraries uh, that I work on, you know, on a regular basis. But look at this. Because I pinned that uh, invoices library under accounting, it got pinned. So now I can easily access it right here, right from my OneDrive, all right? Now, it would typically show you, of course, all the latest libraries and, you know, sites and uh, that you work on, um, you, you know, uh, on a regular basis. But because I pinned it, it's right here on top. And um, essentially, I control what I see uh, in terms of, you know, bookmarks, all right? Uh, let me explain to you the other use case. Uh, that's probably, um, you, you know, the most uh, beneficial uh, kind of situation. I have this other site, another library, all right? So I have another site, a HR team site, and I have this library on the site. And where this, um, you know, pin to quick access comes in handy is the following situation. Anytime you try to move or copy files and folders between sites, um, you need, you might need to, um, you, you know, pin to, you know, for quick access, all right? Let me show you the use case. So let's say I want to move you know, maybe this folder or maybe just a file or whatever from this uh, from this library to this other site, another library, all right? So let's do that. I click, I check the file uh, or folder, whatever I need to move. And of course, I choose move to or copy to. And look at this. On the left-hand side, we see the same quick access panel that we saw in OneDrive, all right? So essentially, it just shows me the sites I visit, you know, the libraries I visit on a regular basis and shows me, like, you know, uh, the, 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 the most recent ones. But because I pinned this invoice library, it's right here on top, all right? So I don't need to, you know, search for it and click more places and, you know, search for it, um, you, you know, that way, all right? It's pretty much right here on top. and um, Again, I I just you know selected this and I can easily move here you know saving lots and lots of time. All right, uh, so this is essentially uh, you know the, what this feature is all about. Uh, it's just a way for you to bookmark the uh, the libraries. You cannot bookmark uh, folders, just the libraries. All right, um, um, you know essentially that way. Um, and uh, if you need to unpin it, uh, what you need to do is, you know, probably the easiest way would be to navigate to OneDrive. And for example, you know what, I no longer need this, just unpin it, all right? Uh, and then it's not going to appear on top. I mean, as you start using all these libraries and sites, you know, this will probably drop off because again, it's not uh, a library I pinned anymore, all right? So that's all I really wanted to show you in this particular video. Hopefully you learned something new. As always, happy to see you on my blog, sharepointmaven.com, as well as my YouTube channel. Thank you very much. Have a great rest of the day. Goodbye.